Hey y'all, today we're going to show you how to make stuffing in your slow cooker all while having a whole lot of fun. Hi, welcome back to another edition of Cooking Chris's Dishes with the Good Old Boy, where we're cooking up dishes straight from recipes that croc.com, which is my beautiful wife's cooking blog. And today we're going to show you something quick, something simple, something fast and something that is real estate economic. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> today we are talking about making stuffing in your slow cooker. First I'm going to tell you what, then I'm going to tell you why. Here's what you're going to need. You're going to need two boxes of your favorite stuffing. You could do any kind that you want. We've got our own favorite, but we're going to use two boxes. These are six ounce boxes, so 12 ounces total of stuffing. One can of cream of mushroom soup, 10.5 ounces, and then you have three cups of chicken broth. That's all you need. And now I'm going to show you the where. We'll do that too. Where are you going to put it? You're going to put it in your slow cooker. This is a how big? I think it's a four quart. Four quart. Little slow cooker. That's all you need because this is a side dish for, oh, I don't know, Thanksgiving dinner. And that's where we're going to get to the why. You're going to take... Awesome. Oh. <laughs> now, now, one thing you want to do is make sure the bags don't go with it because these don't taste good at all. In fact, they don't taste like anything at all, but they're really <laughs> chewy. This is also a good side for a Sunday dinner to you or Christmas mm -hmm. dinner to you. So. Or breakfast if you're weird. <laughs> you want one can of cream of muff, muff, cream of muff from Hey, honey, stop. Use the other side oh. of the can. And it, that's what it's made for. There, see, this is what the little side is made for. <laughs> 150, 160 episodes later, and I'm just now figuring this out. Well, I keep being like, why is he using the wrong side? <laughs> you notice me all go, cream of mushroom soup. <sighs> Evidently, I've got a little Daffy Duck in me. At least I'm not wearing that chicken costume. So you put in your cream of mushroom soup, 10 and a half ounces. And then you put in your three cups of chicken broth. Now this isn't just any slow cooker stuffing. This is the stuffing that we make in our family for every holiday. Because mm -hmm. it's so simple and turns out delicious every time. And it does not last. No. I'm going to stir that up real good. We have an alarm going off. We have multiple alarms. That is the one telling me that my pork chops oh. have flipped. Lunch are ready. <laughs> Lunch are ready. Lunch is ready. Computer, stop. So now. <laughs> I think she, she's sassy. Computer, stop it. <laughs> Computer, stop. Please. All you had to do is say, I tell do you, you what, you just think, like my wife. Do you think sometimes, sometimes I swear when you tell her to stop something, she like continues for like two seconds longer just to kind of be like, I me, think me, Abby me. programmed her. <laughs> now we're going to get to the why. Why are we doing this in a slow cooker when you could say, Mikey, Mikey, why don't I just do this on my stovetop? I'll tell you why. Because again, you can. If you want to do it on your stovetop, you totally can. We're not a stovetop website. We're not a stovetop YouTube channel. We are a slow cooker channel. But here's a good reason why I'm telling you to do it in your slow cooker. Real estate economics 101 with a good old boy. You see, this is a very small space. It is something you can transport to any outlet that handles the wattage of a slow cooker, which is, well, any outlet, probably any home in America. Canada, Mexico, Sweden, who knows? But you've got a stove and you're going to be cooking, oh, I don't know, maybe a Thanksgiving dinner. And you've got to cook your, your stuff in, your corn, your green beans, your, 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 your sweet taters. You've got all this stuff you've got to cook. So why not move some of the stuff you've got to cook away from the stove so that you've got some real estate? That is the why. So in two to four hours on high, we're going to have stuffing. And we're going to show it to you in three, two, one. And about two hours and 15 minutes have gone by, and it's time to start checking the stuff and see how we did. So we cooked that on high 
for two hours or 15 minutes, like I say, you can cook it two to four. As long as there's some liquid in there still, you should be okay. So let's give this a stir. Oh, it smells good. Uh-oh. Are we sticking? Yeah, we're sticking to the side. What I probably should have did before I poured all that in there was maybe put some cooking spray in there, maybe, huh? Uh-huh. Or just stir as you cook, too, which yeah. we haven't been paying attention. So that's our fault. Yeah, but it's still some of that soup. I did not mix in well, which I'm stirring in now. This is real life. This is real life. This is the real life. This is stove top stuffing. <laughs> I want you to show them that consistency because that's the consistency that we like. Yep. If you don't like that consistency, if you want you it drier, that? then I put about two cups of broth instead of, instead three. of three yes but we love that consistency we like part. ours creamy. like spoonable yeah spoonable creamy i like to mix it in with my mashed taters that's what we have every holiday right there but for the sake of science <laughs> and y'all i'm happy to test it just like it is right now it's hot so you're gonna have to give me a minute stuff it and you did it out of the way your stove <laughs> you burnt your tongue i did i could tell <laughs> i burned it all the way down Aww. i need to blow on it longer enough <laughs> blow on it longer than i did people don't burn yourself like i do <laughs> Boom. but that is good stuff <laughs> so two to four hours if you want it a little drier if you want it more bready you know two cups of chicken broth if you like it like we do where it's a little gooey a little a little creamy if you will mm -hmm. especially with that cream of uh, mushroom soup in there that's how we like it then two to four hours on high and with three cups and that's what you're going to get that's how we eat it eat it how y'all like it any way it goes if you like what you're seeing give us one of these down below also if you have not become a member of the crock posse do it do it right now i'll wait Oh wait, you're asking me how to do that? You just click subscribe down below. That little red box down there says subscribe. Click it and you're already a member of the Croc Posse. You can also check us out over at patreon.com slash recipes that croc if you want to learn more ways to support this channel as well as supporting the Croc Posse. And whatever you do, keep watching and we'll keep cooking and all will be well. <laughs> Take two. Mm, three. Three, two, one, and about two hours and 15 minutes have gone by. I've got the hiccups. Excuse me. Come back to us. <laughs> <coughs> Three, two, one.